Welcome everybody to the Yeti vs. Cougar death match here. We got four of these cats vs. one of these big old Yetis. We're gonna find out who's victorious right now. The Yeti is taking swipes at the Cougars. The Cougars are running like a bunch of scaredy cats around here. Will the Yeti be able to even catch one? Come on, dude, grab his tail or something. God dang, he just ground pounded. Almost took two of them out. There goes one down there. Okay, we got one Cougar down, three left to go here. The Yeti is swiping left and right at these god dang big old cats here. This is looks like what happens in my trailer when I try to take my cat to the vet. The god dang, the cat runs around like a god dang scaredy cat like we were seeing here. And I don't roll on the ground like that, but I almost do trying to get her into her cat carrier. But what I gotta do is swaddle her up there and then drop her down into the cat carrier like a god dang pill or something. If, you, if you're following me here, if you can visualize, there goes another one down there. Okay, he's not swaddling anybody here. He is smashing and ground pounded. Okay, three are down. One cougar is left here. How long will it take for this Yeti to take all cougars down? He's doing a pretty quick job of it here. But this last cougar is making a pretty good run for her so far. Sliding around, slipping and sliding and juking this Yeti here. What is going to happen? God dang, dude. Don't ground pound these dead cougars here. God dang, you're beating the dead horse. Yeti, try to catch the, uh, the final cougar. I know he's trying, but he's a little slow. And I think he's, uh, he's big, but he's kind of slow. I, I know a few people like that in my own life here so uh, that's understandable but the yeti needs to get with it here and try to get the cougar that was a close one right there the cougars he's juking them good but he's almost running into him as well he's got to be careful he, the cougar is so quick here he's just running left and right and up and down and north south east and west here okay but uh the, the, the Yeti is going to catch him here eventually, I do believe. I hope so. We're going to be here all day. I'll be here all night if I need to. But the Yeti here, okay, he's really going for the swipe. He's trying to roll into the Cougar. And he's trying to stomp on him and everything else, too. But the Cougar's got a good strategy. Just keep moving. Never stop moving here is what he's doing. So, the Yeti here needs to end it. Come on now. Or the cougar needs to go on attack mode and end it. I mean, what's going to happen here? Are we going to? Am I going to have to call this in favor of the cougars because the yeti couldn't take them all down, or is the yeti victorious because he took three cougars down and the cougars didn't take one yeti down? I mean, what is going to happen here? Let's find out. But uh, okay, okay, he's, he's making a lot of smoke here. There's a lot of commotion, but not a whole lot getting done here. They say the definition of insanity is doing the same thing over and over again, expecting different results here. So the Yeti's got to try something new or just get lucky or something here to take him down. God dang, he's going to catch him eventually. This cougar ain't careful here. He's keeping his distance right now, which is good. The Yeti's rolling and everything. God dang, trying to get a new position here on this cougar. I think he should just grab him by the tail real quick and just swing him up out the god dang arena. Kind of like the bowl did, if you guys seen my last video with the bowl, the bowl got, got, dang, got up under the cougar and just sent him right out to the arena. I said, see you later, alligator. Okay, there he goes. So did the Yeti. The Yetis win, finally. The Yeti took down four cougars. I don't think they even got a claw on the Yeti. I don't know. Here's the replay. We see a swipe takes the first cougar down and sliding away from the from the Yeti there, he almost gets a ground pound on the second one here, and then there goes another ground pound, which I think the shock wave from that took the second Cougar down, and a third ground pound there takes down the third Cougar, and then it looks like a punch from the, from the I don't know if that was a right hand or the left hand, but all Cougars are down. Congratulations to the Yeti. Until next time, this has been Rusty Fluger. Rusty Fluger, over and out.